victim volunteer from the audience. Preferably a single man, but if you're not single, I'll take it. What colour are your knickers? <laughs> See what you did there, Des. That's not what the question is, is it? <laughs> but I'll let you know, I'll just, I'll, you know, give you the benefit of the doubt, my knickers are black, Des. Oh. <laughs> Ironic, isn't it? <laughs> That's what I expect. <laughs> oh, Des, this is so fun. I'll get your number later. Next question. Are you into blood sports? Because it's my time of the month. <laughs> <laughs> So my stuff's uh, it's a little bit rough and ready, but I'm from Wigan, so you should have expected that really anyway. Uh, now I am single, I am single, which I know some of you may find really hard to believe, what would be looking like a young Rolf Harris. Put <laughs> your tape right in. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah I am single at the minute, and my... Um, my ex, I know, my ex-girlfriend said to me, she said, John, you're uh, very, very codependent, very codependent. And um, she recommended I go to a codependence anonymous meeting. Uh, <laughs> yeah. But I didn't like going on my own. <laughs> so instead, I actually bought a book about how to overcome codependence. It's a really good book called The Language of Letting It Go. I couldn't put it down. Hey. Uh, simple crash. <laughs> Thanks for laughing at me. Um, and remember what uh, remember what Alana said as well at the end. Just come up and uh, really caress my ego. <laughs> Thank you. You've been a wonderful audience. Uh, thank you ever so much for coming down. Uh, we hope to have do this on a regular basis in the future. So uh, keep your eye on Facebook. Don't literally do it. Just, you know, just log onto your computer now and again. And, you know. Look out for the adverts. Uh, okay, so all the performers, ladies and gentlemen, come on, let's have a huge round of applause.